I am Marianne Stanya and I'm from Seton Hill University. So Claire is definitely a different approach to psychiatry. Um, it's very holistic, but it's a good different approach. You can tell they really care about their patients and how they progress. Of They can do FaceTime calls and we have patients from all over the place, Utah, Florida. So they definitely take an active part in the relationship with the patients and helping them to get better. I think that, not that I expected all places to prescribe medications all the way, all the time, I mean, um, but Seclair is a lot more about the mindfulness and not so much just teaching the patients about mindfulness and different skills they can use in the daily life, but they also want their students to experience that too. Um, We've learned a lot along the way of different things, like if you're in a stressed out situation, like what can you do? You can go to the bathroom and splash water on your face. You can hold an ice cube in your hand. Um, if you have the chance to exercise and just get out a bit of that frustration. So it's definitely taught me a lot of things myself that I can apply it other where in my life and when dealing with the patient myself in the future. Whereas at a lot of places, you're not taught that stuff. You're not taught the daily skills that you're used in just talking to patients. And here you can tell they're really focused on you. I would say be very mindful, be proactive when you have downtime. Um, it is a lot of observation and participation in the DBT skills groups, but take advantage of that. Um, use and apply the skills that you learn to your daily life. Um, listen to what Doc is saying and how he reframed things. He has a very soothing voice and you can tell that he cares about his patients and he's an active listener. He's not typing on the computer. He's sitting there looking at them and actively engages them in conversation. And when you are sitting at the desk with, when you're not in with the patient, when another student is, use that time. That's when you should learn what happens at a typical office of what kind of medications, what are the side effects of those medications? Because that's not something you're gonna get sitting in with doc, that's something you have to learn on your own because this is the more natural way and they're not prescribing medications to every single patient. Um, it was a great rotation site. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Like I said, it's not your typical psychiatric office, but it's a different, it's a good different view of psych and I wish there was more places like this.